Hey guys, okay, we're past the holidays. It's January 2nd, and um, I'm really, I have to say, mixed emotions about today. You know, it's like I'm really sad because it's over with, but actually I'm excited because it's over with. Um, it's kind of like getting back to the basics of life and getting back to where, you know, we want to be for the 2019 um, new year. Um, so today, what I'm going to be doing is an unboxing video. I got so many beautiful, wonderful decks from my friends and family. As you can see, I have like probably like 15 or 16 decks and I want to open them all up and, and look at them. But then I said, hey, let me show everybody these beautiful cards and we can explore together because each time I get a new deck, even if they're from 15 years ago, two years ago, doesn't matter when, it's like, something brand new to me and that's why i wanted to um i wanted to do an unboxing video on these cards now i know they've been around for a while the um animal spirit deck and guidebook written by written and illustrated by kim kranz now these are a newer deck for me but i know that they've been out for a while and i just want to thank my sweetie my husband for buying them for me i love 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 these cards i've been wanting them Okay, animals especially. I hear so much about them. I've seen them. Um, so anyways, the box is very, very shiny and I love the like the iridescent color. You know, I mean, sometimes the box matters to me. Not that I need a nice box, but I like to look at the box with good quality. And these definitely have them. Okay, let's see if I can open this. Oh, it's a flip top, I think. Okay, not opening for me. <laughs> I'm gonna probably have to go to another deck. Oh, oh, here we go. Okay, I didn't wanna break the box because it is a good box. This is, it's got like a little magnet closing on them. Okay, well, so as soon as I open them, I see a little message. May you always be on the inner quest. And I love that little eye. That is so beautiful. And there's some symbols in the back. Feels like a, it feels like if you ever had an iPhone, it feels like that kind of box. Okay. Packaging, like I said, is not the main thing, but it is important when we buy or get these types of cards in our, in our uh, possession. Okay, so it looks like it's a very long guidebook. Yes, 207 pages. Let's see. I wanna review it together. I don't know if it's reversed. Oh, it's got all the symbols. Oh, the mouse. You know what? I'm gonna look at these cards since they're right here and maybe we'll pull a card and see what kind of message is coming through. Sometimes I do that. I actually open up a new deck of cards and they're giving me a message. Okay, it's a lot smaller of a deck. I like that, I have small hands. But though I've handled the bigger cards, no problem, I can shuffle, cut them, everything, you know, and it's it's really easy. Okay, just like the cover. Lots of packaging. Okay, now the first thing I see is a bear. Oh, that's a beautiful bear. My dog's named Bear, okay. And then we have earthworm, mouse, Rabbit, raccoon, fox, snake, buffalo. Oh, these are beautiful. Look at that. Elk. Now, actually these cards are not like your traditional oracle cards. Um, there are specific meanings because animal spirit. That's why I wanted to um, get these cards. They're very beautiful. I, I have other animal decks, but they're they're not as um, detailed as these. I, I've been hearing so much about what represents in the animals. Okay, fish, starfish. We'll just go on. Octopus, beaver. Mind you, I'm seeing them in reverse. I'm reading in reverse. I think that says oster. Oyster, okay. <laughs> Turtle. Frog. There's the otter. Ooh, shark. 
one. Dolphin. Whale. Wow, these are very beautiful. As I go through them, ooh, scorpion, that's me, scorpion. You know, some messages might want to jump out here. Lizard, I'm just waiting. I'm just channeling as I'm looking. Panther, oh, I love that. Those eyes. I think that's what's on the cover. Looks like it anyways. Maybe not. Tarantula. I'm not afraid of spiders. I'm not. But spiders are unique. Camel. I am afraid of some things, but not them. What is that? Gaz Gazelle. Very beautiful. Tiger. Cheetah. I know, I'm going a little fast. Okay, you know, we can go on and on with these cards, but I have to say, um, these are cards that, these are cards that you really have to, like Vulture, you really have to look at them. There's messages. And you know what, messages usually come through um, when you're examining them. I'm gonna look at them and see if I can pick up something. Oh my gosh, dragonfly. Love the dragonflies. We're not in summer right now. And as you can see, did not have time to take my Christmas tree down. <laughs> but I plan to. You know, it's just been crazy the last few days. Nightingale. Nightingale. And peacock. I mean, they're not extremely colorful. They're perfect. Hawk. And then we have eagle. Now, I, like I said, I... I did not read the, the guidebook on these, and I don't know the specific meanings to them. Um, actually, oh, dragon. Okay, that's the cover. That's the cover, guys. Now, I think every day I'm going to be opening one deck and posting it. Um, IGTV, Facebook, YouTube. Um, just to get a better feel of, like, for you guys to all see them. Um, I might make another video afterwards, depending. But the thing is, is that we all have to um, explore you know, these, these cards, um, these messages, however they're coming through, wherever they're coming through. You know, like I've always talked about, oh, my favorite, sorry, talking and then I see the cards, unicorn. You know, I want to, I want to show you guys all these cards, but it's, it's just, you know, I don't want to lose time either, but as you can see, rabbit, you know what? Rabbit is a good message. It's a good message to tell you that you need to explore. And you know what? Because the rabbit likes to just be very innocent and the rabbit is not harmful to anyone. It's one of the most beautiful, um, innocent creatures. It is a beautiful time to now explore wherever you're at. Um, because of winter, we can't really explore too much, but when we do explore, we do see that there's the beauty in everything. Um, so this, this January, as many times we all say, oh, I don't like January because it's all snow and it's cold and, you know, it, it can be, but you know what? If you really look at it, it's just a month or two. Okay, February is like that too. Okay, I'm not gonna go into the, the weather, but really examine what is around you because that's what I'm doing. And you know what? I'm finding beauty in everything. Don't look at it as a negative. Don't look at it as something is telling you that you need to go away for like the winter and then, you know, come back in the summer because you know what? These seasons are here to, for us all to explore. Okay, so I'm going to um, open up another deck right after this um, video and I will be posting them um, either tonight or tomorrow. So maybe I'll do but one tonight and um, post it tonight and another one for tomorrow. But whatever the case is, I hope that you can explore. Oh, here we go. Explore different things. So I'm going to explore the other cards. Okay, so um, I hope you like these cards. They're very beautiful. Like I said, animal spirit. Very nice cards. I did not get a message. Uh, maybe with the other cards, I just might. So check out my other videos, okay? So um, if this is your first time watching, um, I hope you can watch my other videos. I have several of them. Um, so until next time, God bless.